something that's trendy, and that is getting some great Christmas presents from St. Madeline's Sophie's Gallery right here. And Deborah, let's remind people what so, uh, St. Madeline's is all about. Sure. Uh, St. Madeline's Sophie Center is a center for developmentally disabled adults from about 18, and I think I have a student 86. It's wow. a life program, and this is uh, Sophie's Gallery is one of our programs with for our art program. How long ago did this gallery start? 15 years ago. Wow. It's our anniversary. This is, and this is such a great place to come get some great, because they're all made by people at the center. Right. They're all made by our students that attend, people that have the art ability, come down here and show their ability, and they can earn a paycheck. They sell their item and they get 40%. The rest goes back into the gallery. And I love it. It's everything from jewelry all the way to clothing, uh, everything you could think of right here. Yes, it is. Um, we have fusion glass. We have weaving. Right now we have an angel show up, and a lot of our products are handmade with the ornaments. And also uh, at our garden, we sell plants, so we thought we'd better throw that in, too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and they brought some down here, and there, it's, uh, Kevin uh, pans around stuff. You can see them right down below and all over the place, which is so great. And this is so neat. So, And these are great reasonable price items here, and, and some of them actually have been in shows. Yeah, a lot of our art is in shows or traveling shows. We have some up in Encinitas, Liberty Station, and also we have some worldwide shows where we send art to other places. But the um, art it's just a lot of different art, and we utilize a lot of different products, like even the discs hanging down. Those are from a, a bakery. Wow. And so they made it into something. The wood pieces, we, I think we got them from one of the colleges yeah. that made the angels. So we're very, you know, we need items like that. We're a small business in the downtown area, and um, we just participate with the community at a big level. I love it. And you're right here at El Cajon, as we mentioned, downtown El Cajon, but also the young lady next to me, Lindsay here, works at... Uh, at what store? Because I didn't know you guys. When did you open this? You guys work where? You work where? I work for Sophie's Kensington out on Adams Avenue. I love it. And you were telling me that uh, it's Christmas time. Yes. And what are some of the things that you love over there to uh, to have people uh, buy? Um, one of our biggest sellers right now would probably be our purchased giftware. And a lot of our homemade jewelry is selling, too. Oh, wow. That is so great. And, that, and that's when did you guys open that one up? It's been there for two years. We partnered with the Autism Research Center. Association right next door, so we use one of their spaces and partner with them and collaborate. Oh, this is so great that they're, they're doing this, and so it's a great way to do some shopping. We're going to actually be going into the gallery's uh, work area and showing you jewelry, all kinds of stuff that they're making here. So it's Christmas time. What not? Uh, why not a better place than Sophie's Gallery to get some of your great Christmas items, Carlos? So uh, when we come back. We'll talk more about that, and we have more. Good morning, San Diego, for you coming up right after this.